Everyone, it is 643. Welcome back to Great Day for this Thursday, the 11th of June. And time to find out what we can catch in Des Moines this weekend. Boy, oh boy, Greg Edwards from Greater Des Moines Convention and Visitors Bureau. Lots of things going on this weekend. Whoa. It's, it is a fun packed weekend, kids. <laughs> How much bet, fun? Yeah. How we're, much fun? We're getting to the meat of the summer here. Yeah, we really are. Well, you can kick it off tonight by heading out to the Salisbury House to catch Much Ado About Nothing which uh, of course is a famous Shakespeare uh, Is that going to be play? a wet show? Uh, I don't know, is it Jason? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> but that's I don't, it, I don't uh, like uh, affecting ticket sales, so we'll That's true. We'll be positive. Now I assume Bring they move inside to do this if it is raining. Yeah. Um, mm. Otherwise it's shown out in their that's beautiful true. garden. That's true. They area. have the house to go into. So you can check that out tonight. There's a little scene of the uh, so much much help do her. about nothing. <laughs> <laughs> she looks like she's it is a fun experience. It's a gorgeous place to go see a show, and it's a fun one for the full, whole family. If Shakespeare scares you, this is one it's very easy to understand and a lot of fun. That's good to know, because mm -hmm. Shakespeare does scare a lot of people. <laughs> it does. Ooh, so there you go. Scary. Moving on, Pride Cabaret is also tonight and oh, tomorrow night. Okay. And uh, this is at the Temple Theater downtown, Des Moines uh, Performing Arts. And uh, this kick off the Pride Pride Festival yep. weekend, um, but this will feature the Des Moines Gay Men's Chorus on both uh, doing shows both Thursday and Friday night at 7:30. Twenty dollars will get you in the door there. Um, and I'm not sure why that Prairie Meadows thing came up. We just up, like horses. Came up. Nightfall on the River um, tomorrow night. Now I heard, I thought I heard that this moved to Seven Flags. Had you guys heard this? Oh. I saw a piece on the news last night that said because of the uh, forecast, but tomorrow night's supposed to be all right, isn't it? Yeah, oh, it should be beautiful. Well, yeah. so you might want to check out the website. Maybe that's the rain location if it maybe does in, happen to be in rain. In case it's maybe a rain it is. location. Okay, okay, let's go with uh, Simon Estes Riverfront Amphitheater uh, featuring Michael Franti and Spearhead. Ooh. Nightfall on the River tomorrow night, downtown Des Moines. Uh, one of Lou's favorite guys is in town Saturday That's night. Right. Yeah. Tony Orlando. Hi, uh, Yellow River. What Run. happened to Dawn? We don't know. We asked that last time we talked about him, and we, uh, we need to find out. Let me see what I can yeah, find she's out. She's still Their she's whereabouts. still around, right? Yeah. But he okay. still looks good, though. He yeah. looks he looks darn good. Yeah. So Tony Orlando tomorrow or Saturday night, 7:30 at Prairie Meadows Casino, Racetrack, and Hotel. Um, tickets start at $25, shows at 7.30. But apparently you have to knock three times before you walk in. Oh, oh I like it. And oh, maybe you tie a that. yellow yeah. ribbon yeah. or something, yeah. you know. Yeah. Um, we just mentioned Pride Fest this weekend, all weekend long, Friday through Sunday, running in East Village. Um, it will be a very colorful <laughs> event, as it always is. Uh, there'll be, of course, big street parties, musical performances, lots of food and beverages. Madison. That's, uh, That's Madison. Yeah. Fun yeah. stuff. Madison. He's Madison been on this Ray. program. Oh, cool. Well, you know them all. So uh, check out Pride Fest also this weekend. Yeah, Pride on Sunday. top of it, uh -oh. the biggie. Uh -oh. The biggie of the okay. weekend. All right, so before we continue, which, who's your favorite superhero? <sighs> Probably Batman. Okay. Ooh. All right. Are you going? Yeah, I'll be there tomorrow night. Are you dressing Batman? up? Well, I have tights on. I don't know what else. <laughs> Greg Edwards sporting tights and nothing Edwards else. If you see Greg Edwards, ask to see his tights. Well, I just wear a tights and a wife beater or something. <laughs> <laughs> You're your own kind of so superhero. Typical Sunday. I'll be my own superhero. <laughs> typical typical Sunday, Sunday. Yeah, well, I'm we sorry. are asking this on our Great Day Facebook page. We want to know, are you going? Because everyone's talking about this. You bet. And if you are going, do you plan on dressing up and... Oh, cool. Your favorite? Yeah, Get it's just kind of fun to hear because oh, a lot of people bet. are really buzzing about this. So oh, what's going to happen when uh, cosplay meets the... Um, uh, the cross-dressers at the parade. Are we going to have just some obvious? <laughs> <that's> <laughs> what happens then? I, I don't know. Yeah. It will be an interesting it's be all explosion. In the same area. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you, so Things you can check that out happen. at the Iowa Event Center all weekend. We're anticipating 20 to 25,000 people. Do, you, that wow. many? Do yes. we have any idea of how many Huge. people from outside of the state are going to come in A for lot. something like this? You know, we don't yet, but I mean, we're told it's going to be just Tremendous. Huge. This is a big deal, yeah. isn't it? The big guy. Uh, oh, that's yeah, Batman yeah. calling you right now. Yeah. It's Batman. <laughs> it's Commissioner Gordon. Tell oh. Robin I'll call him right back. It might have been your tights, lady. I'm not sure. Though. Tell Alfred to write oh, the back. It was, it was my seamstress. <laughs> your seamstress. <laughs> we can't she find needs a, your measurement. Yes, let it we out. We can't again. find a short <laughs> pair for you. But, but you know who our favorite superhero is right now? Who is? For the time being, go to the, go to the surface. 
That's great. Look at that right there. Uh, Lou Ferrigno. Look who we were hanging out oh, with yesterday. Cool. Yeah, he was very cool. He'll be here tomorrow. He oh, looks neat. good. As well as a bunch of the hey, other superheroes. Okay. But the line for Zubro yesterday, because in, in anticipation of him being there, went from the front gate all the way back to where the camels are. Really? Yeah, just waiting to get in. So it wow. was a big deal. So, but this is it'd be even a bigger deal for Comic Con. I'm excited to uh, see. I, I, you know, I want to go just to people watch, but just find if people like if how far they traveled to be a part That's of this. That's a good event, idea because yeah. it's just supposed to be huge. It is. Now yeah. we're going to have a booth set up there, so maybe we'll, we can have a thing. Where did you? Where'd how you, far yeah, did you travel? Get a map that would, that would and, be yeah. interesting. That would be cool. Yeah. People tell us. Yeah. Good deal. Um, <laughs> Clive Running Festival is Saturday morning. Oh, there's more. <laughs> we can oh, ask there's him. more. There's more. We could ask them how far away their mother's basement is. <laughs> That's me. Where's your, mom, where's, your mom, where's your mom's basement located on this map? I like that. <laughs> Here come the emails. I do not live in my mother's basement. I live in the basement. Straight up, shine. straight up, kids. Right. Time to move on. All right. The oh, Clive. Oh, you want that? would be awesome. The oh, Clive, Clive you're going to have a run. Good for you. Okay. We're, still, we're totally doing that. Go ahead. Um, and that kicks off uh, Saturday morning, 8 o'clock. You can run the beautiful Clive Greenbelt Trails. You can do a 5K, a 10K, a mile run. A tadpole trot, which is more along my there line. Um, it all kicks off the Clive Aquatic Center, 8 o'clock Saturday morning. And while you're out in the area, you can catch Saturday afternoon at 1.30 the historic baseball game at Living History Farms. Of course, this is the Walnut Hills Blue Stockings. And they compete in 1870s rules baseball, and the kids can get involved after the game and all that good stuff. You can see how miserable people were in the 1800s with their wool on playing baseball in June. In Iowa. Oh. Let's yeah. hope it's nice and hot and humid. Huh? <laughs> um, Mediacom World of Outlaws Spring Car Plus 360s. That's, at, that's the Outlaws the are coming. Raceway. Yep. That's the biggie. Yeah, those are the big boys. And, and their uh, shots, Donnie shots right there. Lou, you might as well talk about the. Uh, State Fairground yeah, race Yeah, fairgrounds are starting early. Uh, they're starting at 6. We got rain halfway through the event, so we are starting right at 6 o'clock sharp tomorrow at the Iowa State Fair Speedway. They're going to start with uh, finishing up the sprint car race. They had four laps down for that. They're going to finish that one up, then the program, the other features. Then they're going to do the whole next yeah. week. And then the following week, on, on the 19th, there's no races because of the rodeo that's over at the fairgrounds. Oh, sure. So that's going to take precedent to because of all the parking, so they can get all the parking. So. National Junior High so, School six o'clock oh, yeah, early, awesome to early, have back. early start tomorrow night, and they're starting right at six o'clock. They're not going to waste any time. Right on. Um, another run you can do over the weekend: the Run to Exile. Okay. That's Saturday morning at eleven a.m. Um, that's the uh, it all happens at Exile Brewery downtown. You can join the fun. You'll receive a T-shirt from Exile Brewing, Brewing Company, a pint glass, a custom finishing medal, and party and beer after you finish. 11 o'clock Saturday morning, $45 will uh, get you to participate in that. Um, kind of a new event, the Urbandale Craft Beer and Food Festival happening out at Walker Johnston Park, uh, at Park, what? not Parker. Um, at the EJ Giovanetti Center. They're going to have beers, craft beers from all over the U.S. Wow. Um, of course, they'll have bands and food and yeah, other fun activities to do. Yeah, this is going to be a really fun event. Yeah, it's supposed to be a great event. Writing this down. In Urbandale. Right. That's uh, Saturday noon to 4. The Summer Antique Jamboree on Sunday. You can wrap up the weekend from 8 to 4 at Historic Valley Junction. Of course, it's a free event, one of the largest they give you a free antique show. Oh. A free what? Maybe there's a fish on that logo there. You get a you get a free sturgeon as you come in. Oh, yeah. yeah maybe you do. Yeah. Candy sticks? Say no more. Phosphorus? <laughs> 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 Salt water tabby. There you go. Um, <laughs> also kicking off Sunday at 1 o'clock, if you're looking for something to do, something more to do, is Des Moines Beer Week. And they're going to tap the keg at El Bait Shop at 1 o'clock, and uh, it'll run festivities and things happening in all our different oh uh, craft beer bars throughout the metro starting week long tomorrow. starting sunday sunday okay and sunday des moines heart walk uh saturday morning if you'd like to help out the american heart association gates open over at western gateway park uh around 8 a.m with, with things kicking off more at 8 30. if you'd like to help me survive the schmell and family reunion saturday afternoon you can get in a car with me and wow. go back up to northwest iowa heading up to Cherokee. Whew, we'll see what happens. Wow. Check it out. Take take pics. <laughs> <laughs> Check out Jackie's Facebook over the weekend. Could be kind of wild. Be taking advantage of the beer week yeah. on Sunday. <laughs> Woo, Cup. family reunions. The Cubs are in town. The Iowa Crush play Saturday night at 5 o'clock. Uh, the Menace are in town. Menace women. 
um, Saturday night, 7.30. So Lots if, you're of if you're bored, you're boring. You're boring. You're boring. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Now, if you uh, want to find out any details on any of these things, where do they go? Simply go to catchdemoine.com. Beautiful. Well done, as always. Thank, Thank you. you, sir. Thank, Thank you, you, guys. It is 6.53. We'll be right back. You're watching Great Day.